What's up, Granders and Grandettes? We got to talk about this. So, Kanye West, uh, as you know, Kanye West, he is, he knows how to get you talking. If, if it's silent about Kanye West, he knows anything he can do is going to get you talking. So, uh, this is, this is foolishness. Um, Kanye West decided to wear a White Lives Matter shirt. So, he was at uh, an event in Paris um, at a Yeezy show in Paris. And he and some of his models wore a shirt that said White Lives Matter. Now, listen. I believe human lives matter. It's cool. But the dangerous rhetoric behind wearing something like this. This is ir it's irresponsible. It's really irresponsible to me. Because the Black Lives Matter, why I don't agree with the organization, I think they're, I think it's a, a scam. I just think that, you know, they, they profit off the, the pain and anguish off of uh, families who have actually uh, went through tragedies. And I think they profit off of it without helping the families in return. Um, but the statement Black Lives Matter was, it came from a, a, a place of, it came from a place of just trying to get that out there. Like, listen, we're not trying to be killed by people who are sworn to protect and serve us. But I just want to tell you black lives matter. Like, I'm not saying my black lives matter more than you. I'm not saying we we, we matter uh, slightly better than you. I'm just saying that our lives matter. Not saying we our lives matter uh, more than the next person or the next race. But... In hindsight, if you didn't care about the movement or if you didn't support Black Lives Matter, cool. We didn't look at you. I didn't look at nobody a different way for that. But I understood it was I understood the propaganda behind the statement Black Lives Matter. Um, it started, I think it started from something pure and it just got convoluted. And obviously, in like anything else, it became uh, more about profit and gain than it, it became about helping people. But when you say the statement White Lives Matter which was used as a complete contrast to Black Lives Matter. This was what people, white people, other people who didn't agree with the statement uh, Black Lives Matter would say, well, white lives matter. Well, all lives matter. And that's cool. Human lives do matter. All do. But at the same time, certain groups and minorities in general face different problems than other pe other a, a, di a, a, a different demographic of people. Sorry, I'm getting a little tongue tied. So when he says this, and then he's standing next to Can Candace Owens in a picture, who's somebody I agree with some of the things she she says. She's very intelligent. I, I do. I, I will admit I agree with some of the stuff she says. Oftentimes, I just think that she's she's just trying to appease my son some type of way too. She's just like one of those. Intelligent woman, but I feel like she's one of those uh, black people who, who looks to get validation from white people. Um, and sometimes that comes with putting down your own race. And I just, I don't agree with that side of it. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's something with all these people, Tariq Nasheed and, and, and uh, uh, Dr. Umar. I just don't, I don't agree. You know, but that's what makes me me. That's that's what makes everybody individually. But back to Kanye West to promote this. And I don't know if he's trolling or what he's doing, but it's just why. It's just why. At the end of the day, why? Like, what, what, what are we gaining from this? How is this pushing anything forward? What is this saying? I, I just can't get with this, man. Love Kanye to death. Great artist. Got a bunch of classics. One of my inspirations. But I'm going to call you out on your bullshit, dog. Like, this is this is it's stupid. It's just irresponsible and it's stupid. Like, what's the point? You're supposed to be getting... Listen, once you get your Pray for Buffalo shirt or something, man. If you want to uh, support a movement, you know, uh, people just got killed in Buffalo. In May. May 14th or 15th in Buffalo, New York, my city. And I was down there, ground zero. I didn't see Kanye West there. I saw that Big Sean came after. 
But once you support a real movement, once you like you got you got all this money and all these power, once you once you come down to Buffalo and 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 and, and get some pray for Buffalo shirts. And do what you can to help the families like I did, you know. And I'm not rich. I'm not by nowhere near at all rich. But I did, you know what I made? I, I made a, a clothing line called Pray for Buffalo. And the proceeds went to the families to help them out because that was my way of trying to help out. I don't get this. I just don't understand this. I think this is corny. It's whack. Uh, you, you might get a diss track from me for real, for real. Uh, and anybody who, who defending shit like this, I think you lame as hell, too. You know? And if this is a ploy just to get people talking, that's lame as fuck, too, dog. And listen, I understand you got biracial kids. And shit, I got biracial kids, too. But I, you think I would walk around with a White Lives Matter shirt? To what I'm trying to... I don't understand. What I'm trying to get some approval from some, some white folks or something? I don't give a fuck what you think about me. This is lame as fuck, bro. You need to get fucking smacked in the back of your head. We're, you need some real niggas around you to tell you this shit, Wack. That's what you need. You need fucking Rhymefest or Consequence on one of these motherfuckers to tell you, nah, that ain't it, bro. Jay-Z, what the fuck is wrong with you, bro? This is why they don't fuck with you like that. They try to let you in, and then you just do some lame shit like this. Bro, you lame as fuck. Kanye West, I don't care to never fucking work with you ever because you just do lame shit. And I can't keep defending lame shit. Because I'm not a lame nigga. So, fuck you, Kanye West. Um, don't try to... Listen, we ain't fuck... We, don't try to come out. Matter of fact, you see these fucking Yeezys right here? I got on your fucking sneakers. I'm about to burn these shits. I'll fucking burn these motherfuckers right now. I'm gonna fuck. See that? That's what the fuck I think about you, you piece of shit. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Peace.